So how should I start this again? You should start it out by saying what he just said. Four score and seven minutes ago, <laughs> I was told by my brethren about the challenges in life. We face many challenges, my son. What can we do to overcome them challenges? I don't know! But we will find out. The only cure to negativity is food. <laughs> scrambled eggs is a metaphor of how scrambled your life is. You just got to keep on learning. A walk through life can be filled with many obstacles. A walk through life can be very challenging at times. There are things that are beyond your understanding and beyond your control. When life gets you down, it is something that creates devastation and doubt and guilt and shame and condemnation. All these convictions within your heart gets you down to a lower standpoint. But there's something that is going to give you a higher level of expectation, a higher level of understanding beyond your understanding. The passion that drives within your heart, the fire that is, is, is burning inside you cannot be stopped by your own human control. There is something that is greater than your purpose, greater than your life, greater than what you have here on earth that is wonderful and amazing to comprehend and grasp. This, I'm gonna share with you guys something today that gave me a new level of understanding, a new level of encouragement to build upon my daily challenges, my daily tasks that I have in my life today. Back when I used to be able to um, enjoy my free time, I had a level of passion towards dancing. Dancing was something that was a part of my life since I was very little at a young age. My father and mother gave me um, so much encouragement to give an artistic ability and creativity in my life to build upon at a very young age and I am grateful for that. I am grateful to have all of these opportunities come my way to be able to do what I love to do, do the passions that make me happy in life. I was encouraged by my father with music and by dancing that gave me another level of understanding of passion, of what it really means to be happy. I want to want to share with you guys something that is going to give you a level of understanding. Job chapter 28 verses 20 through 28. So where does wisdom come from? Where does understanding live? It is hidden from every living thing. Even the birds in the sky cannot find it. Death and the grave say only reports about it have reached our ears. But God understands the way to it. He is the only one who knows where it lives. He sees from one end of the earth to the other. He views everything in the world. He made the mighty wind. He measured out the waters. He gave orders for the rain to fall. He made paths for the thunderstorms. Then he looked down at wisdom and set its price. He established it and tested it. He said to human beings, have respect for the Lord that will prove you are wise. Avoid evil that will show you have understanding. Whenever testing and tribulation begin to become present in your life, having the knowledge and the wisdom and a new level of understanding is important. I would recommend that you guys go through life not covering your fears with a blanket. I would recommend that the fear of not fitting in doesn't have to be where you are. It doesn't have to keep you stuck where you are today. I would recommend that replacing your fears with the passion that is in your heart is the best decision that you could ever make. That level of understanding higher than your expectations 
It's what's going to move you forward whenever you are down in your down days. It's going to take that extra step for you. It's going to keep you going. It's going to keep that fire burning. A lot of people struggle with anxiety. I have noticed this for quite some time now. And uh, honestly, I've, I've dealt with anxiety myself. When I used to dance, I used to have the fear of what people thought of me whenever I was performing on stage. I had all the, the, the jitters and the nervous feelings and butterflies just like anybody else would when, when they were performing for, for an audience. I began to have the fear of what people were thinking of me while I was dancing. But as I really dug deep down inside myself, I found a level of joy and happiness that overcame all the fears of what anybody else was thinking about me that drove me to the next step in, into performance. It drove me to the next step in a new level of, of becoming greater than myself. I began to build upon that and, and, and instill the level of confidence that was more than myself. What I encourage you guys today is to find that level of passion. Find that level of encouragement that's going to make you understand and move forward with it. What's your passion? What is your passion? What do you want to accomplish? What, what creativity is going to be yours today? Find a level of passion to understand the level of the Holy Spirit working through you. Once you find that passion, that will be your remedy. And you will be able to achieve all that your heart desires. Thank you for viewing in on another segment into your journey. It is a blessed time to be with you guys. These are good days. These are good times. Enjoy it while you, you are here. Thank you.